Good morning, guys. It's okay to mess up, right? Now, when we want to finally, maybe after a long time of considering lots of different options and waiting for the right time and deciding that you're going to action and implement your plan of, you know, whatever it is that you want to do, health-wise, whatever, yeah, there we go again, you know, your thing, right, so whenever you've, you've made that strong decision, and it can be December, like, when we think about it, in some ways it doesn't make sense, but, I mean, you've got Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, New Year's Eve, I, I don't know, Boxing Day. Do we overindulge on Boxing Day? Yeah, 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 yeah of course we do. Um, so I've got four days there. Morning. Hello. So I, I've got four, four, yeah, four days. Um, um, yeah, sounds good. So four days of overindulgence over the, the festive period. Um, yeah, I, I can certainly keep my head screwed on um, and look forward to... Um, like I'm, I'm, I'm going to eat more chocolates than you. Whoever's watching this, I, I'm going to eat more chocolates than you, right? Let, let's have a competition, right? But let's have a, have a healthy competition at the end of the month. Um, so yeah, just, just on that one with the four day thing, if I was going on a holiday for a week, that'd be seven days at least of eating, resting, drinking, and I'd actually be more motivated to, for that. But in some ways, Lots of people are the opposite with December, even though it's exactly the same. We've got a period of, of overindulgence coming up. So therefore we use that as a reason to be demotivated when, it, when it's a holiday, that, that actually motivates us. Funny, isn't it? A bit, a bit weird as well, right? Anyway, that wasn't the, uh, the main point of this specific video. So yeah, it's okay to mess up. Because, again, we have to be intentional. We don't have to be. It's helpful to be intentional in the sense that we, we set goals, regardless, regardless of the outcome, regardless, right? It doesn't really matter what happens because then we can reflect, we can learn, we can adjust, and we can just decide what we do next. It might be that you say, you know what, that goal, I'm not gonna make that goal again, all right? For example, if you've gone round in a circle, if you, you know, the weight always goes back on, it's like, I'm not gonna focus, at least on my own, I'm not gonna focus on the weight. When I focus on the weight, the number starts to be a distraction, I go, it, it goes well, and then something gets in the way, I make, I mess up, you might say, and then the number goes the opposite way, and then I fall off track, and I get busy and I'm distracted. So that might be an argument for at the very least not focusing on that on your own because you've not got the oversight. You're too in your situation. You can't see the wood for the trees, etc., etc. So the reason, the reason I've decided to put this specific video together is, is pretty straightforward, although we've just had a... a a uh, good conversation about kind of the mindset of, of December and you know we've, we've not spoke about how do you want to start your next year it, it I'm, I'm guessing it's not in first gear I'm guessing it's moving forward I'm guessing it's setting yourself up for success you know like that's another conversation but the reason that I've put that I've decided to talk about it's okay to mess up it's not necessarily because we all do although that's true, like things drop off, we get busy. Because the reality is that messing up is how we learn. And it's, it's how I'm walking right now, right? I would have, can't quite remember learning to walk, but I'm guessing I would have fell over lots of times. Um, it's a little bit spiritual, but I, Read in a, in a book, it was uh, like Buddhism, right? It's, it's uh, fall down seven times, stand up eight. 
yeah decent quote that one anyway let's move on so yes we are going to make a mistake we are going to fall off things are going to get in the way but this is something this is actually directly from my program this is actually something that i discuss i've got a complete module on on the psychology of why this is good and i've just decided you know what i'm just going to give this away today morning, morning. just gonna just gonna gift it to you and it reflect it goes back to the learning because on the other side on the other side because you've got like have i messed up do i think i've messed up do i feel like i've messed up because yes you can make a mistake it's like you know one of my many injuries it's like yeah you don't want to do that mate like don't do that again right it's, i messed up right you have a car crash you messed up like you know like there is things that you can genuinely objectively say yeah i messed up but that said often due to the mind and it being naturally negative to try to protect you and thinking about things that you've done in the past and you know looking at the future and making it making it worse and then you know it starts to eat away at you and all of that stuff right the vast the vast majority and i'm talking um 95 percent maybe and that's just my opinion by the way take it or leave it but in my experience again gifting this to you today in my experience the vast amount of times that people mess up it's actually they, they haven't they, they, they think they have they feel like they have and i'll give you one quick example which will ground us you know it'll give us something to reflect on just and it's not it's not huge but i'll, I'll give it to you just so it kind of links all this together one of our clients dropped 2.7 kilos in a week you know decent but but you know a few months back decent all right happy got a lot of weight to lose driven determined you know fire with all cylinders but, but a couple of things that he'd not done right on a weekend he got busy and didn't, didn't do a couple of walks like nothing just, just didn't walk right and it was like that that's i've, I've not done what i said i'm gonna do which i, I get I get it was social occasions you know things like that it's a weekend for god's sake right and i was and i said to him just so i'm clear you've lost 2.7 kilos this week and you've you've messed up right you've you've not done what you say you're gonna do okay what what are your thoughts on that and he was like oh that's that all or nothing thing isn't it and I, what do you think he said yeah now the thing is, I mentioned seeing the wood for the trees. Like, the people that I coach, they're not daft. Like, they know this stuff. But the thing is, when you're running businesses, saving lives, working all the hours under the sun, flipping heck, it's easy to forget. And it's just having someone there just to say, okay, is that true? Like, what do you want to do about that? Like, how's your week gone? You know things like that right things that actually work in a world of absolute garbage quick fixes so it's okay to mess up yes because that's how we learn again that's how i'm walking today a lot of the time it's not that we have actually messed up it just might be that we will change the goal change the focus if we focus on the outcome then maybe focus on a process you know i don't judge the quality of these videos by how many clients join my program. I'm like, you know, how do I feel about that? Is that valuable? And besides, at the end of the day, we're gonna get better by doing. Happy 1st of December, speak to you tomorrow.